Hi guys, welcome to Zoned, it's Z here, and today we're going to be doing the second episode in a little series where I get to interview some of my favourite YouTubers. Um, today I'm going to be joined by a god named Fleet. So Fleet, hey. thank you for being here. Hey, you called me your favourite YouTuber. <laughs> One of my favourites, but yeah, definitely man, definitely. I've learned a lot of tech from you. Um, yeah man. So first of all, uh, just tell us a little bit about yourself for any viewers who might be unfamiliar with your channel. Alright, so uh, where do I start? Well, we'll start with the simple stuff. Uh, I am a DBS Broly main um, mm -hmm. for the most part. Uh, that's my character. Love that guy. I'm in real life. I'm in Terry. Have been for the last 16 years, 25 years old. Mm -hmm. uh, into fitness, very heavily into fitness. Um, you know, currently trying to train to, to get better at the, the game because eventually, with the way things are shaping up, this time this year, sometime this year, I might be able to compete offline tournaments. So I really want to be ready and, you know, stand my mark even more so in the community and what I might have already have. Yeah, definitely think you can do it, man. I've seen you mm -hmm. play. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have a lot of work to do, but it can be done. So, how long have you been a YouTuber for? Uh, my channel has actually been alive since 2015, but I didn't start recently going heavy into it until December of last year. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I've noticed you had a lot of older videos like Destiny content and stuff like that. But I think it's fair yeah. to say um, the sort of the shape the channel's taken now is relatively new. I would say, and and, yeah. and you've grown. You, your channel's grown a lot in that time, which is which is which is very impressive. I'm I'm happy for you in that in that sense. Yeah, I, I guess in that area, uh, I just, I mean, one of my friends came to me and said, "Hey, man, you know, you're really good. Why don't you just, you know, make a you know YouTube videos?" And at first, I started like Team Gohan uh, TODs, and then I was like, "Well, you know, well, let me see, let me see what happens if I actually put some effort into this for a year." Yeah. You know what I mean? To see where I go. Because yeah, I thought yeah. by the end of the year, my goal was actually 365 subs. Because I was kind of, hey, maybe I get one, one sub a day. A day yeah. Right? <laughs> and it definitely didn't work out like that. <laughs> I mean, so. yeah, that's um, so obviously you mainly do Dragon Ball Fighters stuff, which is what I know you from. Because that is my, hands down, my favorite game at the moment. My favorite fighting game of all time. Um, is it, would you say fighting games are your favorite genre of games? I say they're the most complete genre again when yeah. you buy a fighting game the only thing you're gonna have to worry about in that fighting game is a balance patch yeah like, you know <laughs> what characters are broken but other than that you know, dlc you don't really need dlc mm. uh other than to like bring in new characters and give a little bit more content but the content in it on its own is just a fighting game experience like because the outcome of every fight will be either win or lose, but the fights are always going to play out differently no matter the opponent. Yeah. You know, so yeah. that that alone just keeps it fresh. That's why Dragon Ball has been alive and running for so many years with very, like, it had a lot of changes with the Season 3, but for the most part, the core aspect didn't have to get reworked. Yeah, Example definitely. to that would be, like, Destiny. When it first launched, it mm. damn near had to do that whole game over just because of how bad it was. Yeah, definitely. So, uh, how, how long have you been a gamer? Probably all my life. Yeah, I can relate to that. <laughs> what, what, what was your first console? Do you remember? Uh, Nintendo 64. See, I never had the N64, but um, a friend had it around his house, so we'd all go around there to play Smash Bros. The game was like the monopoly of video games at that point. <laughs> Definitely. What's your favorite platform to play on? All uh, right, now PS4. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a Sony fanboy, always have been. So I approve of your choice in platform. <laughs> <laughs> what um what other games are you playing at the moment other than Dragon Ball Fighters? So me and my friends we play a lot of different stuff. Um, yeah, Friday Thirteenth is just fun to play with friends. Like there's so much wacky stuff that happens. Do you still play Destiny at all? I took that. I, I, I sold that game. As I didn't <laughs> get my DLC for free whenever I pre-ordered it, mm -hmm. yeah, I took that thing back. Fair enough, man. Fair enough. So, when you started your channel, did you have any sort of obviously besides the 365 subscribers? Do you have any sort of goals for the channel of like what you wanted to do with it, or are you just sort of improvising and just seeing where it goes? 
So how it goes right now, my my thing has changed, right? So at first, I just wanted to see how far I can get within a year. My goal since then has deviated and has changed due to like recent events, you know, to me actually looking and, and experiencing more life, right? So yeah. now I want this channel to connect people because if you look in there in my communities tab, you'll see a backstory on me as yeah. what I went through through the 20, like uh, the events that I went through 2019 to 20 and what I went through as far as the struggle that I had to go through. Uh, I mean, if you don't mind me talking about a little bit of it, um, what it was is that, uh, you know, I came back from like going overseas and whatnot, and you know, I was I was doing great. I had a, had a good job, I had money in my pocket. Mm. You know, me and my lady was doing great, you know what I'm saying? But yeah. somewhere down the line, uh, I got real depressed. And when I got real depressed, I started losing everything one by one. Mm. Um, where I once was pretty strong, I'm not as strong anymore. If, you know what I'm saying? I gotta go back to the gym. Just getting back into the gym. From yeah. then till now, just also, um, I'm gonna use that as a way to like, you know, who could go on that journey with me as well. But, yeah. you know, I lost that. Couldn't keep a job because my head, I had, I don't know, some type of battle going on with myself so I couldn't stay focused. And I just didn't feel like I wanted to be there. You know, it's just not, you know, I wasn't giving off a positive vibe, you know. Mm. And then, you know, my lady said, that, you know, I was changing and she didn't like it. And our relationship almost ended. And then, you know, it just, everything just started going downhill, you know. And mm. Nothing, none of it was going to lead into the right direction. But that being said, uh, very recently, I've, I've, you know, coming out of this struggle, went ahead and put my story out there, to, you know, because I was just counting my blessings out loud. And yeah. when you do stuff like that, you know, it really hits deep. Yeah. I want this channel to like more so connect people. Everybody in the FGC community, respect the top guys, Dato, Rufo Monger, uh, you know, Lotus, uh, mm -hmm. Rhyme Style. I respect them, but my goal for this channel is to be better than them. Yeah. You know, and I know that's a hard, a hard step and pill to say, and you know, step to take and a hard pill to swallow, but that's my goal because I can't. I got so much I can offer and bring to the table that I know I can fill a fill a gap and be something that I know they're not. You know yeah, what I mean? yeah, abs absolutely. I can yeah. I can respect that. Do you feel like you're making the progress? You you well you you've already said that you've um you've already made in less than a year. You've already made more progress in terms of subscribers than you'd wished. But in terms of like content and maybe quality of the content that you're producing do you feel like you're making the progress you would you would have hoped for yeah yeah i mean i could improve in some areas like for anybody who didn't know i don't have a capture card how i get all my gameplay footage and edit it my process is that i record it on my playstation mm -hmm. i put it on the flash drive take it to my laptop put it in the editing studio which i use premiere pro and then i go about the editing process through there um I'm pretty sure if I had a capture card, it'd go a lot smoother. You know, I also would love to get a face cam. Um, yeah. You know, for the for like streams and also like you know when I do videos because my facial expressions are hilarious. Like you, <laughs> you ever you, you ever play fighters and get hit by absolute bullshit? Like yeah, <laughs> like cross All up that wasn't time. supposed to happen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. You just sit anytime in the, in the you face try to cross up bottom. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like every time that shit happens, and I you'll see me throw my controller. <laughs> just, <laughs> <laughs> you know well you'll, you'll you'll get there eventually maybe when the ps5 comes out if it includes that camera like it's like it looks like it might do you might not have to get a face cam that is true if it does that'd be really good well if the price tag that was leaked is true it better include something is what i'm saying <laughs> i didn't even see the price tag what was it well there's a it's a leaked price but they're saying around 750 dollars which yeah exactly which apparently it's just a placeholder price on amazon but i mean if it costs that much it better include the camera the remote control all of that stuff for free because it better have a big massage of 3000 in that motherfucker, bro <laughs> <The> fuck <laughs> 700 bones yo that's a <laughs> hopefully 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 it's wrong hopefully it's wrong because it's tough times out here whole world's in lockdown we haven't got that kind of money to be spending on consoles right <laughs> But yeah, so um, is there anything you would say for any YouTubers just starting out, any advice you'd like to give them or, or words of wisdom you think you, you'd like to share with them? Uh, yeah, so any words of wisdom I'll give to you. If you have an idea, 
you know, take it, run with it. Because you never know what could lead you. Like, I started with just PS4 and it, uploading through that and editing actually on Share Factory. And I got mm. up to 700 subs just through that alone. Mm. So that's how I know, like, through sheer determination, having faith in yourself, believing in yourself and just your plans. You know what I'm saying? You, you can literally get there. Like, like I'm telling you guys, when I started this, I only had 56 subs to my name. All that was from Destiny. So I'm like, well, when me going to a Dragon Ball, it's dang near like I'm starting all over. Mm. I comment section, you know what I'm saying? I had nobody for like the first 10 or so videos. And then after that, you know, I got lucky. Someone saw it and they're like, oh crap, this is good. And then, you know, it just snowballed from there. So if you guys are out there and you're just scared to do it, you know, you, hey, go to my channel, hit me up. I'm, I'm, I am a very, very social person. I will help any and everybody I can give you advice personally, personal advice. Like, if you need help doing something, I'll invite you to a PSN party. I've done it with multiple people. Everybody actually that's asked. You know, all you gotta do is ask. I'm not afraid to, you know, saying like, no matter how big I get, I think another staple of this channel that I want to make that clear to everybody is that no matter how big the channel gets, is that I will never try to like, if you ask me, you know, for help, and and, uh, and I try to get there to you. I'm gonna try to help everybody I can. You know, that's, I think that's the one. Thing. I know I'm not gonna be able to, but I want to make the effort. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I want to at least make the effort. Mm -hmm. And the, the fact know, that you're trying is what counts. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Because I've seen some YouTubers, who shit, they they make people pay for their time, and I'm like, mm -hmm. bruh. At the end of the day, you're just a YouTuber. Yeah. Like, and this is your community. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, you're just a YouTuber. Like, mm -hmm. you're not that damn important to you got to make this guy pay because he <laughs> watches a video for free of your time. You know, you're not that important. Like, yeah, no. absolutely. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He, this guy is the reason what him and many like him are the reason why you got money in your pocket and you're <laughs> making him pay to like for your time. That's bullshit. Yeah. That's the bullshit. I don't follow behind that at all. And think no name drop nobody. My name is six nine or nothing, but you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's just me. Now, yeah, that's one of the things I like about you, man, is the, the positive attitude, that positive mentality. I try um, to sort of... I, I try to only get involved with positive people because um, I believe positive, positivity breeds positivity and there's, there's enough negativity and toxic people in the world. And I like that you're out here just trying to just be yourself, trying to stay positive, just keep on looking up and that's that's something i respect a lot man oh, that's all it's about well i appreciate you taking the time to do this with me man uh any uh, last messages that you'd like to, to to give your followers uh my followers hey yo check this guy out i like this guy <laughs> cool he's real cool <laughs> thanks bro well um i think that's that's pretty much it uh remember to subscribe to a god named fleet everyone and thanks for watching hey peace